Good morning. Well, it's actually not morning. It's afternoon. All morning, I've been... Um, I walked Willie. I washed my brushes. Cleaned my house because yesterday was kind of a mess. <laughs> which is fine. And then I've been watching, like, Oprah. And she has, like, her YouTube. And it's just little clips of um, her show. And I every single one, I cry. So I've been crying for, like, an hour. Just because... I'm gonna walk Willie again. I want to run with him and like you know do uh, play for his people. I don't I don't know how to leave him off a leash. I just get nervous. But yeah, if my eyes look kind of sad. It's cause I've been crying. Yeah, they do look. They look kind of cry. So let's walk this bad boy. Wanna go outside? Let's go outside. When this happened, like when did this happen? Like it's finally summer, and like I went out and I'm like sweating, like in my little creases in here, I'm sweating, and I haven't even gone to the gym yet. I didn't really sweat much, um, partially because I was already sweating in the car before I even got to the gym, and then the gym was really cooling, and I only did arms. That was hard. I did a lot of weights, like a lot of different variations. I'm so glad I went. So I stuck to my schedule because it's always important to like kind of schedule and map out like what you're going to work out each day and just so that you kind of keep yourself accountable because like what I always when I plan it out I'm like really motivated and excited and then like if I don't work out I'm kind of mad I feel bad for my old self you know what I mean I'm like letting my old Susie who was sitting there planning motivated excited I feel bad for that Susie and walk my dog I'm gonna walk my dog we're gonna play fetch this is how bad I am at throwing a frisbee. I'm so... I, I don't know how to flick it. Come back, Willie. I just don't know how to throw a frisbee. But he's such a patient baby. He doesn't carry the way. He's so non-judgmental. Oh, that was a good one. How good Willie is. What a good baby. Okay, I'm going to keep practicing my throws. But this is a pretty proud moment for me, and really, right? Because you're off a leash! He's so used to Brian's throws, and he runs way faster than my throws. I'm a little bummed. I just caught Willie literally like, like this <laughs> all over the pizza. Like, what the fuck? Who wants a Labrador? Who wants a potty trained Labrador for free? Anybody? 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 Nobody? Anybody? I'm getting ready right now. Um, I have to go to Skokie, which is a, like a suburb of Chicago. And um, my bronzer's not working, really working. It's just like a dry patch there that won't stick. Do you see it right there? That happens sometimes. But yeah, if you notice that I haven't been vlogging a lot and haven't been you know, recording the last couple of days, it's just been like pretty... There's nothing special about them. Um, although on Monday, I did have a girls' day with my girlfriend, um, who's a makeup artist. Her name's Pegan. And that was really fun. But otherwise, and I didn't pull out my camera for some reason. But then after that, I was just editing videos like crazy. Like, I just can't stop. Like, I can't stop. They're so good. <laughs> my videos are so good. No, they're, they're just, like, exciting. They're fun to edit. I like, kind of wanted to just see, like, what they how they end up and stuff. So uh, that's what I've been doing. And in the downtime that I have or any kind of viewing time that I have I'm watching Oprah like old Oprah clips I fucking love Oprah but and then I was crying a lot too the last couple days just because I've just been in a mood to watch stuff that makes me cry I don't I don't know what it is but I'm getting ready now I'm gonna take you guys along my ride and um, I'll talk to you guys later I feel totally guilty because I have everything in my house to make smoothies like everything but I was kind of running late, so I had to go to Walgreens and get one of these guys. These are my favorite. I used to have these all the time in high school. But then I had to get some stuff that I really wanted. Okay. I just need a blush because I wanted to transfer some of my good blushes into my kit. Desanitize them, wipe them down and stuff like that. Because there's some good ones that I just, I don't need the good ones, you know? And I wanted to try this. It's a wet and wild blush. So that's cool. It was like $3. And then I've been wanting these color tattoos because I tried a the toughest taupe one and it's just so good. 
So I wanted to try these two. These are the le leather versions. Creamy beige. It just looks like, it's like beige. I wanted it like a, almost like a primer because um, the other one stayed so well and I gave my soft ochre to my sister and I don't want to get the MAC one even though they're probably the same price at this point. Yeah, I'll put it probably been the same price. I just wanted to try this one and then this is like a brownish color. It's called Chocolate Suede. This one kind of looks like a little bit metallic, but I wear so many browns that this would be perfect. This is a foundation that I was looking at and I was like, oh, what if? This is amazing. Um, this is supposed to be like amazing for your makeup and skin. This is a Neutrogena long wear nourishing makeup. And I got two tones because I just never know which one's mine. Yeah, so th these I'm actually really excited. As soon as I go home, I'm going to try these. All right, I'll see you guys in a bit. Cause there's little, there's little seeds. That's it. Well, there's more in there. Wow. You didn't even read the direction. Hold on. I did. What did it say? How many should we put in there? Well, it's a small pot, so I'm not putting a whole lot. Put a lot in there. We're, I was gonna say we're cooking lavender. <laughs> we're planting lavender. And Brian is on with the green thumb. I just look. I just look from afar. Otherwise, I'll kill them. What's in here? Let me see if it'll grow. Okay. Let's give this to somebody. Share. Share the love. <laughs> so all of yesterday, I was looking at recipes to use with Crisco. Just because I bought Crisco and I feel... Well, there's I think there is a difference between the butter and the Crisco. So anyways, I was looking at recipes. This is one... And I only found recipes with like ingredients that I have in my house. And then last night I found it's another recipe. And I found this and I really want it. Does anybody have any information on these? It's it clips onto your cell phone like that, so you can have a ring light in your phone. It's only 20 bucks. How cool would it be if it works just as good as a ring light? Just for your selfies. Anyways, okay. So I think let's see if it's I think this one, this is the one that had a really good picture. But then I see this one. This batter looks amazing too. It's still delicious. Yeah, I normally I don't go for batter like that. I'd go for batter like that. But I think you're on the same page. And these look like good. In my last video, uh, Brian, remember when I said I wanted to try this? Yeah. Yeah, I think you're on the same page. Yeah, because this one has like a little bit of 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 like a little so one of Willie's many talents is knowing people's reactions when food drops. Is that? So I have it goes. Oh, what? And he knows. <laughs> He's looking for it. He knows our reactions when when, when food drops. Just looking, looking, making sure nothing falls. Hey. So I'm getting ready for. A night out which is very unusual because it's Wednesday night and um, we went to some concert like kind of performance can you see that these new lashes I just bought them at uh, Walmart they look like these. Oh, those look awesome so these are from I just saw like a bunch and I bought them all <laughs> but a lot. It was in Skokie, Illinois. They don't need lashes over there. But I, have to, I don't know what I'm going to wear. It has to be casual. It's like casual, but my makeup can't be casual because I need to make sure that my makeup looks cute because I'm a makeup artist. Hello. And um, it's raining outside. You can probably hear it. it. Sounds like hail. This one's really nice. It's the, it's the leather versions. And this was in chocolate suede. It has like it has like um like a hint of it's like iridescent it's really pretty i like it and i like these kind of looks they're just so easy i literally used this and black eyeliner that's it i might film in there actually we'll see i don't know
Well, I wasn't tripping, I was swiping. I just did the treadmill. That's the only thing I did. Yeah, I was kind of grooving to it. Okay, we're waiting for emissions test. The, an emissions test? Emission. Just emissions test. Like waiting for emissions test. Wouldn't you say waiting for an emissions test? Okay. And the line is like crazy. It's like around the corner. And Brian's looking on Yelp. And he goes, Yeah, I think I want to take you out to brunch. I'm looking for the cheapest places with $1 signs. What do you think about that? <laughs> I was like, uh, Good, it's fine. When you put it that way, it sounded like not really sweet at all. It's being cheap. It was being cheap. It's fun to be cheap sometimes. Is hey, this Whirly Ball? There's bumper cars in there, yeah. It's Whirly Ball. That's Whirly Ball. Okay. I was gonna say, oh, there's people in there. Yeah, they're you Whirly. see them? They're Whirly Balling. They're Whirly Balling. Bull. When I was like in seventh grade, I think. And then there was like a private room and people set up to play spin the bottle. <laughs> and I just kind of, I observed. I didn't play. I was just scared. And we're antique shopping and I was so sweet and I said yes <laughs> I kind of get bored in places like this a little bit too easily but it's cool looking I just don't love looking for actually I don't have anything to look for that's what it is and it's Brian nerding out But we're still antique sh shopping, looking. And while we were waiting, I was like, ooh, there's a hair salon across the street. So I ran there and just got a quick trim. I really just needed them to blend out my bangs. Honestly, like, the way I style my bangs is always like, I don't know what. Shit, did I just mess it up? Hold on. But I just needed them to blend into like these layers so that it framed my face a little bit, kind of like that. Um, so I look a little different because I just got a haircut. Antiques, antiques, antiques. There's so many things in here. This is just one room. There's like a downstairs, upstairs. This is our third antique shot that we've been in. Okay, look what we found. We found a Chinese whisk to blend out your contour. We're at Lula's. We've already eaten entire quesadillas and goat cheese. And we're over at Logan Square. There's a Logan. There's an actual square. <laughs> this Coco size is it was three dollars. This size used to be fifty cents, and then the smaller one was twenty five cents. So I think that's right. This morning is a very exciting day for. A lot of people in Chicago, just not me, kind of. I'll live vicariously through my sister, but she is going to the Beyonce concert. So I'm getting her ready for that today. So I'm gonna bring you guys along. I took my little doggie out for a, a long frisbee. I'm getting better at throwing a frisbee, like way better, but it's gonna, I have to like turn my entire body this way for it to go that way. <laughs> so 
I'm still working on my form. I'm gonna make myself a smoothie. If you haven't seen my smoothie video, it's up. It's, oh, and yeah, my hair is cut. I'm, I'm gonna see how how to play with it. I just, you know, it was such a, it was very like um, spur of the moment type of thing. I just wanted it just fixed because my hair was dry naturally that day. And it was just so like, it was getting really annoying at how long my bangs were grown out to here. And they were here. Um, so that's a lot of inches. And so I was just like, yeah, I just cut some length and she cut a lot of length, but eh, we'll see. At least I'm having a hard time finding what she's gonna wear tonight. Oh, so. <laughs> and it looks so pretty, like. I can't, I can't even. Right? Look at it. Did you contour your clothes? What? Look at my clavicles. Did you contour that? No, no. bitch! <laughs> Lord, this is real life! From here down is real life. <laughs> Beyonce. <laughs> So after probably eight different variations of like nine articles of clothes, we finally found one that we liked for Lily. Well, I liked the first one, but she did it. And then, um, but everything else is done. That took forever, girls, man. That's how she does it. Let me see your makeup. That's pretty. I just dropped my sister off, not at the concert, but they're having dinner before. And um, I like the way her makeup turned out. I think I want to recreate it because I've never, I don't think I've done that combination on anybody or on my channel before. I'm just waiting for my husband because I was kind of here like an hour early, but that's how it is. That was so fun doing her makeup. Uh, I already dropped off my my husband at work and then I, my sister happened to be right in the same area so I dropped her off at home um, and I resisted going to brunch because I was like no I have plans I have to go to the gym like today was my leg day so yeah girls that's that's a hard that's hard to do especially when they're like come on I'm like no I really need to um, the other thing too that I'm preparing for and the reason I'm like persistent about going to the gym is um today's mole fest i'm saving my calories for mole and tortillas and maybe like enchiladas if they have enchiladas de mole and anything else they got yes 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 gimme 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 mole 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 oh that blotchy realness though yes 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 oh my god that, i'm like neon that's this is like my favorite way to leave a gym if i'm not looking like this like what the fuck was i doing at the gym then i'm gonna go home cool down walk my dog and start to get ready and get my appetite for this mole fest it is so nice out here i'm not supposed to have my dog back here but I get a back. right wheelie we don't give a fuck so we're in pilsen now we're gonna go to the mole fest our sister well, my sister ditched me. Well, she didn't ditch me. She had brunch, and then she's like, oh, I'm gonna meet you guys after. I'm gonna take a nap. I'm like, what the fuck? We're gonna... Whatever. So, Brian's still debating on bringing his camera. He doesn't have to bring his book bag. But I'm hungry. I already saw pictures on Instagram of, like, a mole tamale. Oh, fuck. And rice on it. Oh, Brian and I were like lost for probably 20 minutes. We walked this, this, this to find our parking spot. We couldn't figure it out. But now we're just hanging out at Lily's. We're just kind of kicking back. Oh, I wonder if you can see. 
Yeah, you can. And I'm gonna read this book just right now. Your postcards and people send like their truth. And so they write like really revealing stuff in there. So I'm gonna read them. Oh my gosh, Batman. You're wild. Um, I didn't get to close out yesterday's vlog, but I'm not gonna vlog today. So this is the end of my vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.